What's up, dogs? It's your boy Kamar Red here to bring you another episode of the Fantastic Naughty Dog Collection. This is Uncharted 4 A Thief Sand. I'm your top dog, and before we start, smash that like button if you enjoy this episode. Click the subscribe button if you want to become a top dog of the channel. Link will be in the description down below for you to check out the rest of the playlist as well as the rest of the video so you can see how we got here in the first place. Without further ado, hop on the train, enjoy the ride, enjoy the video, enjoy the episode. Let's go, dogs! What's up, Sammy? Hey, give me a hand. Alright, so last we left off, let me see if I remember. We were checking the crypt of Henry Avery, or going to the crypt of Henry Avery, in hopes of finding more clues to his treasure. Henry was a pirate, and his crew, they stole a ship worth of 400,000 gold or something. Yes, we are. Dude, this is surreal. I... I... The last couple of days I've been playing Brutal, Uncharted 2, and 3. I finished Brutal playthrough of Uncharted 2. I platinumed that one. So now I'm working on Uncharted 3. Uh, we have those playlists on the channel as well if you're curious to check them out. Look at this place. Welcome to the St. Dismas Dormitory. Oh. final resting place of one Henry Avery. Picked up a journal entry. Let's find that grave. The dormitories. Nathan, oh, we can read. Hold on. Check it out. This one's got a pair of cutlasses. Read the dormitories. <laughs> As I was saying, and now seeing like this frame rate, seeing this HD quality is incredible, dude. It's impressive. Just like the cross. So this is where all the pirates that died, I guess. Were buried or something. Oh. It's like Ray's been digging around already. Jot this down. Find a journal entry. He has no idea what he's actually looking for. <laughs> no. But he could get lucky. Hope not. Uh, general injuries are pretty sweet, actually. So it's like he's taking his own notes to make his own jur uh, journal. Kind of like diary, to make his own diary. Nathan Drake's diary. The fortune pirate hunter slash pirate. Alright, now what, Sammy? What do you propose we do? Also, I've been afflicted with some allergies as well, uh, unfortunately. So if you might find my voice to be a little different... I might occasionally sneeze as well, so I apologize before it happens. Hi, right, Sammy. Let's. Go. Oof. Ah, you're you're stepping on on sacred sites, Aka. That's not that's not good. Hey, where you going? I'm gonna look over here first. Uh, okay. Why the question? Like I thought we were supposed to be looking for something. Oh, hold on. Where are we going? Hey Nathan, the tombstones are over here. Yeah, mate, but it's like, what is this supposed to be? What the heck is this supposed to be? Okay. Uh. I didn't mean to fall there. <laughs> oh god, Nathan. He's like, I told you the burial site was here. The tombstones were over here. Oh, did I pick that one up? Oh, I don't have it. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. Okay, let's stop making the same mistake again. Let's follow Sammy. That might be where we have to go after the fact that we explore the tombstones. Might have to go that way. True, like a true pirate. Happy. Tempus Edax Rerum. Oh, the dates aren't right. Well, one down and oh, a hell of a lot to go. Henry's bravery needs to have ah skull and crossbones cross towards pin pointed down. Dates still no, nope. got it. I'm not patient enough for this. Nice joke. Scottish gravestone. <laughs> okay. Cross cutlasses, skull and crossbones, and the date 1659. Ah, that's why Sammy wanted me to check these tombstones. I see. All three, and we're in business. Ooh, the swords match. Let's see. Uh, date doesn't match. It's 69. Nope. Bad dates. <laughs> Bad dates. 
Oh, that's the right. Just a friendly reminder that no one escapes judgment, huh? No one escapes death. They're pointed up, but why not? Huh. Date is correct, but the swords are upside down. Yeah. Also, One. oh, there's a skull. There we go. Skull. What's up, dude? How's your day been? Well, I'm just checking gravestones, so. Not having that much fun. Okay, that's the wrong date. Wrong cut, last two. There we go. Need to see the date. Yeah, well, swords are a match. Ah. This is the year. Ah. Sam, come here. Where'd you find it? <sighs> Benjamin Bridgman. That's Avery's alias. I was about to say, yeah. Uh, looks like an anagram, no, but I didn't so check. Looks like it doesn't belong to the stone. Ooh, looks Pull like it out. That's not Avery's sigil. <laughs> Skull should be facing sideways. They're so romantic. Sideways. Well, that's pretty obvious, isn't it? <laughs> that's pretty obvious. Oh, he thinks it's gonna be treasure. Mate, we are on chapter eight. Let me teach you something about Enchanted. If you've played three adventures like I did before, Sammy, uh, you'd soon realize they usually take 20 chapters. On chapter 8, the heroes tend to be close to the treasure, or potentially finding the treasure, but they find out that the treasure is actually not here, and they find clues to go to somewhere else. Take a note. One of the old monks wrote this. Hmm. A miracle at long last and on our good Saint Dismas feast day. Weeks after we learned the crown's intent to shutter our cathedral and reclaim our lands, a stranger wandered into our midst as my novice and I concluded our morning prayer. A subtle vision with flint colored eyes and a thick why am I changing accents? Unkempt beard. He was clothed in a naval captain's uniform bearing a magnificent sword and a large 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 leather satchel. We bade him join us and he graciously accepted. A mutal at mealtime, the stranger related a sad tale of a battle at sea and a desire to bury his fallen comrades on sacred ground, confessing a kinship of sorts with our good Saint Dismas. And thus we shared our own tales of woo. The, grands, the grounds in disrepair, no money forthcoming from the crown, and the cathedral abandoned save for the two of us. He nodded knowingly before drawing out of his satchel a quantity of gold coins, the likes of which I ne never seen. The stranger offered us this gold in exchange for our land and all the structures contained within the grounds. Though my beliefs conflicted with my desires, in the end, I felt to turn him down would be foolish. With this amount of gold, we can certainly do more good elsewhere than here along this forgotten coastline. As for the stranger, may these lands serve his intention as well, whatever they may be. The stranger is probably in the re, and they paid him with gold? <laughs> Close journal. So we got a note. <coughs> Excuse me. Perhaps I'm getting sick. I think it's allergies, but I'm not sure. Alright, Sammy. Where did we come from? I came from here, right? Got it. Alright. We got our notes, and now onwards we go. We have a crypt to find. Treasure. Ooh, speaking of treasure. What's up, boy? Treasure to find. Uh, that's gonna be your boys, isn't it? What's up, Sammy? Oh, oh. Gang's all here. Yep, and that's Saint Dismas. Nope. Jesus. <laughs> Dismas on the left. Penitent thief. Gestus on the right. Gestus. <laughs> A jerk thief. Ooh. What's up, boy? We received the due reward of our deeds. Avery sure had a thing for Saint Dismas, huh? Well, Avery fancied himself a good thief, right? Mm. He plundered and murdered the non-British heathens. I see. <laughs> Guess that's what passed for good back then. <laughs> good enough. We see the journal entry. Dismas, good th thief, Jesus, guest us, jerk thief. Cool, I'll just hang here. You guys have fun. Today you will join me in paradise. We received the due reward of our deeds. Got it. Now what? 
found our boys. Oh, what's going on there? Some kind of lamp. <laughs> hey, Smokey, need your lighter. Oh, another lighter. Hey, Smokey. No, that hurts my feelings. You know, I miss Sully. It's in these moments of lighting up stuff that I miss Sully the most. You know, that's his usefulness, right? Ooh, lights. The lights coming from the other side of the wall. I'll be changing statues. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Let's rotate the stuff. Ah, I can aim the lights. Mm-hmm. There we go. I believe that's six, right? Two for each, maybe? There we go. Ah, so those two are supposed to be up there. Just let me double check, though. There we go. There we that go. Looks right. Oh no, this one. There we go. Ooh yeah. That's it, you got it's like a constellation. Of course I got it, Sammy. Who do you think I am? Done this my whole life. We good? Looks like a constellation. Ooh. Yeah. That's Libra. Hey, I just said that. Looks like a constellation. Choice for a bunch of pirates. Journal entry. Libra. The moon was said to be in Libra when the city of Rome was founded, and the sun passed Libra on the aut aut autumnal equinox back then. So they associated with with balance and later with justice. But why did Avery choose this sign? Interesting. Okay. I rotate. Probably opens the door. Now what? Open sesame. Is that the Shintamani stone? Shush. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong treasure. Oh, well, nice view. No treasure, though. Oh, what? Well, but, look, you see those crosses? Oh. Uh, oh, the cave. Is that a cave right below? Yeah, I think Avery's trying to tell us where to go next. You know what's strange? It's like you go to the place to find another place to then find There's another place. Problem. Going back that way means we have to go back toward the cathedral. What happens if someone accidentally finds the final place? Well, that's not keeping you know what I mean? It's like Avery went to all this trouble to lead us into whatever he wants us to lead. Whatever he wants to lead us to. And then it's like, what if someone accidentally found the final place? Raftel, right? But Aka, to find Raptor, you need to find all the Poneglyphs because the island isn't doesn't exist unless you find the Poneglyphs. What are Poneglyphs, you may ask? Shit. Oh shit. Ah, oh, dang it. Good. That's the way we gotta go. See, there we go. That's that's what I was predicting. If you don't know what Raftel or Poneglyphs are, you should Google that. Because it's amazing. It's an amazing show that you should watch or read, in my case. Okay, there's this fella down here. Let me just uh, cuddle real quick. Alright. Oh, I'm feeling lonely. Thank you. Are you good, sir? To ignore the edges. Recircle to what? I did not understand that tutorial at all. Ah, shiza! I tell you what, crushing is a lot more. It's a lot more. Uh, what is the word I'm looking for? Benevolent. What's the word I'm looking for? I was thinking the word, not really the game. Uh, crushing. Sammy, you were never the intelligent brother. Now let me tell you that. You idiot. You're not detecting me, dude. What are you talking about? 
Tim, not even close. Shut up. Let's go. And oh yeah. Oh Sammy. Dude, I just want to fall down. I just want to fall down. Alright, Sammy. You are not very intelligent. Let me tell you that. Shut up, dude. Turn around. Nothing to see here. Turn around now. What? What's going on here? Is that a cut? What is going on here? He's behind you. And that's not good. That dude took like 10 shots to die. Shit. He still didn't die. <laughs> Alright, boy, let's go. No, I know what I'm doing now. See? Easy game. Now we do this. We go kill that one. Ooh! Ah! Clean, baby. Clean boy, what's up? Oh, you want to buy out? You want to dance? We're dancing, baby. What's up, boy? It's behind you, Apple. Oh. Oh, Sammy. What's up? Hello. <laughs> Welcome there. The foop out of my way, boy. That's Sammy, right? Yeah, yeah. Because the guy was shooting her. Get the foop out of my way, boy. Let's go. Want some, baby? Yeah, I should just do this more often. We're supposed to be like running and gunning and then punching people in the face. What's up, boy? What do you want? Dude, die already. What the heck? There we go. Oh, he's low. He's really low. What's up, baby? Should check your dentist. You may have lost the teeth there. Mmm. Sweet, sweet taste of, of, of killing. Of ad shouting. Yeah, just keep moving, I think. I still don't know where he is, but I have an overall general position where he is, but not entirely sure. Just keep moving. I think he's up here. No? Maybe moving. There's like two left, maybe? I've killed like what seems like 10 enemies already. Maybe even more, actually. Sammy has killed. I don't know if Sammy killed someone. There he is. What the heck, dude? Die! What? Who's there? Is that Sammy? I have no idea where Sammy is. Oh, there's Sammy. What's up, boy? Oh, are you kidding me? How do you... <laughs> How do you land a grenade there? Oh, I hit him. 
There's three at least. What is Sammy doing again? This is so tense, dude. Every fight. I like it! Adrenaline, baby! I wish sensitivity was, was... See, where sensitivity really hurts is when they start running, you want to follow their path as you shoot them. And it's almost impossible. Unless I, like, lightly... T see, there's... But this is ridiculous, because it's like... I have to gently touch it in the middle of an adrenaline-rushed fight. Like, I don't have time for that. That's why I put sensitivity on zero, so I don't have to, you know, lightly tap the analog. Is that it? He commented, so I'm assuming. Let's go, baby! What's up? Alright, dogs, I think we're gonna call it here for today's episode. Oh, that was intense. But before that, actually, let me open this gate. Might as well collect the spoils of war. Uh-oh. R1 quick throws dynamite. Good job, Aka. You had dynamite. You also didn't use it in the fight. <laughs> I'm still used to... I mean, after grinding Uncharted Trilogy for so many hours right now, I've done... Basically, I've done... Three play through, playthroughs of each of the three games. Uh, one on Crushing, that's on the channel. You can follow that. those playlists. Uh, they're over there on the channel. Link will be in the description down below. As well as doing a playthrough on Brutal. That one, I, you have to grind a lot for it. So you know all the small details of enemy spawns and, and whatnot. And then, we've also had to uh, do a continuous speedrun of... Two hours and whatnot, sometimes two hours and a half. The other one was three hours and a half, and then the other one I think is four hours and 15 minutes. So I'll, I'll, I'm currently doing Brutal on Uncharted 3. I'm actually on the last chapter, so final boss is kind of easy, but the Jin fight is probably going to be really tough. I'm, I'm basically at that fight. Uh, I, haven't I haven't tried it yet because I know it's going to be a pain in the ass. But anyways, dogs, thank you very much for watching. We're going to call it here for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching. Smash that like button if you enjoyed this episode. Click the subscribe button if you want to become a top dog of the channel. Link will be in the description down below for you to check out the rest of the videos as well as... Yeah, was cool. As well as the playlist. <laughs> my brain stopped there for a second. Anyways, from the bottom of my heart, a big special... Ah! To all dogs, peace out and... Bye-bye.